he is led as a lamb to slaughter. And as a lamb before his shearer, he is dumb. And so he opens not his mouth. In his humiliation, his judgment is taken away. Who will declare his generation? For his life has been taken away from the earth. Wait, wait, that man! Will you? Wait, stop, stop! Wait. Stop, stop, stop! Shalom. Will you ride with me? You're very kind. Yeah, come, come. You're from Jerusalem. Are you comfortable? Good, good. I suppose you could call me one sympathetic with the Jewish scriptures, uh, like my queen. Arkandas of Ethiopia, yes. <laughs> Your office is high, I can see. I'm state treasurer. As a state treasurer, uh, we are expected to carry part of the treasury around on our box. <laughs> Whenever we travel, that is. <laughs> but when I'm at home, I dress much more simply. I call myself a simple man. Also, a reading mouth. My personal treasury is my books. But there's still... I'm such a simple man, there's still things I do not quite understand. Like your Hebrew scriptures, for instance. These. These. The prophet Isaiah, ah. yes. He was led as a lamb to the slaughter. Who? Who is led as a lamb to slaughter? Who does Isaiah mean? Himself or someone else? Somebody else. Who? Who? It will take rather long to tell. We have time. Look, around. Nothing but desert. <laughs> we got time. You tell me. It had happened as the prophet had announced. A maiden will conceive and give birth to a son, and they will name him Emmanuel, meaning God is with us. And Isaiah said, A voice cries in the wilderness. Prepare a way for the Lord, make his path straight. And John the Baptist appeared in the desert, baptizing people with the life-giving water, as Jesus asked us to do. You want me to go in the water? Will you? I baptize you in the name of Jesus Christ, 